grieving South Carolina groom whose bride killed hours after wedding battle's mother-in-law over a state report. Samantha Miller, 34, was killed by an alleged drunken driver on April 28 as she was leaving her wedding reception in Folly Beach in a golf cart. The groom, whose bride was killed by a South Carolina suspected drunken driver on their wedding night, is now embattled in a legal fight with his mother-in-law over control of his deceased wife's estate. Lisa Miller, mother of 34-year-old Samantha Miller, is even contesting the hours-old marriage between her daughter and Eric Hutchinson, the Post and Courier reported. The bride was killed in April when their golf cart was struck as they left their Folly Beach wedding reception. Jamie Lee Komorowski, 25, of New Jersey, told police she drank a shot of tequila and one beer about an hour before the horrifying April 28 collision. Komorowski allegedly slammed her gray Toyota rental into the couple's golf cart while traveling 65 MP, twice the legal limit on the island near Charleston. Months after the tragedy, Lisa Miller filed a petition to remove Hutchinson as the personal representative of her daughter's estate. She claims her daughter would have wanted her to get a share of the inheritance. Eric and I agreed several times that Sam would want us to do everything together, given we're the two most important people in her life, she told the newspaper. I never wanted to challenge the validity of the marriage. I never wanted to dishonor Sam. But I feel like Eric is dishonoring my daughter and going against her wishes. Hutchinson's attorney told the paper that his client has been more than generous with his mother-in-law. She has repaid him by threatening to bring a frivolous challenge to the validity of his marriage to Sam, attorney Patrick Wooten said. One would hope that Miss Miller would have too much respect for her own daughter to do that. After praising her son-in-law following her daughter's death, Miller said she was alarmed at the speed with which Hutchison moved to cash in on the tragedy, the report said. His lawyer said he has offered Miller half of any recovery in a wrongful death lawsuit if she stopped challenging the validity of the marriage. Eric has made this settlement offer not because Lisa Miller had a valid legal claim she does not but rather because he is a generous person and, of course, would prefer to avoid painful, public litigation over the validity of his marriage to Sam, Wooten said. Miller's attorney, Jerry Meachin, said her main reason to intervene is to protect the estate of Samantha Miller and all of its rightful heirs. There is no reason to rush the process and cloak it in secrecy, he claimed. This was a money grab from minute one. Komorowski is charged with reckless vehicular homicide and three counts of felony driving under the influence. A wrongful death lawsuit names her and four bars accused of over-serving Komorowski on the night she allegedly drove drunk.